we always say, what's within goes without. And take a cup of water for an example. If I pour a crystal clear uh, water in a cup, it eventually, what overflows from that cup is a crystal clear water. If I pour a dairy smelly water in that cup, when it overpours the cup, it's not going to change itself to crystal clear water. It's just going to maintain the same essence. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now, our thought, our emotion, as we are filling up our container energetically, internally, have the same quality. Mm -hmm. So, as we are emotionally sending more sad message, more anger, more envy, even if we don't express it, it doesn't matter. The fact that we thought it, the fact that that thought crossed our mind, it has been sent as a vibration, as a wave, internally. Now, if someone says, oh, thoughts are not waves, they are not vibration, mm -hmm. then how do doctors uh, use uh, EEG, mm -hmm. electroencephalogram, mm -hmm. to measure the, uh, you know, uh, 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 brain waves, the pattern of the waves in the brain? Mm -hmm. Absolutely. So it is. Mm -hmm. Emotion, same thing, it's wave. Mm -hmm. And if someone thinks, Oh, there is no wave or vibration in the body. What is pulsation? What is heartbeat? Mm -hmm. How does a uh, small intestine move as, the, as digesting the food? And so on and so forth. Because what's a common denominator throughout the entire divine is vibration, is wave. Mm -hmm. Then the next is what's the quality of it? Is it does it have the highest quality which is uh, love? peace, happiness, or it has other qualities like sadness, uh, envy, anger. Now quite often people may think that they don't have a connection with the divine love, mm -hmm. but the way you can imagine it is like this. Imagine that you go in the sun and you have sunglasses on, and slowly it gets closer to sunset, but it's still bright out there. And you look around and say, oh, it's so dark. And somebody walks to you and says, what do you mean it's so dark? There's still sun out there. So no, as far as I know, it's dark. I say, okay, why don't you pick up your sunglass and see the sun? See how bright it is. The person picks up the glasses and says, oh, it's pretty bright. The negative emotion, hatred, sadness, envy, work just like that sunglass. They block the light, the vibration of the divine. Just because the vibration is blocked, it doesn't mean it's not there. Mm -hmm. Now I want you to hold that thought, Amin, because we are going to uh, play a tape of, um, of a meditation that um, you, you have done earlier oh. and throughout your, your <laughs> course here in, in Wisconsin. And, uh, and perhaps we'll be able to talk about this also yeah, and great. do an explanation of basically what we've been talking about. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. So uh, Sounds great. Very good. So we'll watch the tape and, uh, and our audience will see this tape. And um, you can maybe talk a little bit about um, the, the wording, the, uh, the emission, and a little bit of yeah. what, what's going on the, uh, with everyone. What I'd like to ask you and we may open that to up to our audience if anybody and, would care uh, to uh, eyes, talk please, about uh, and just their experience. Become aware of your breath, every inhale and every exhale. It's going to be a calm one. Slow down your breath. Become aware of the fact that you have the opportunity to breathe in divine breath with every inhale. It doesn't only have to be air. We all have a unique connection with the divine. Through that connection, with every inhale, we have the opportunity to invite the divine breath to enter our body, 
every organ within our body, every cell within the organ, with every exhale, we are exhaling divine breath. As we are inhaling the divine breath, it's going to our organs, cells, providing nutrition, as well as divine love, peace, and happiness for us. We all have this connection. It's a free subscription for all of us. It's always been part of us. We can always benefit from it. 